Hey kids, it's circle time. Today is Thursday, May 29th, and all you have to do for your direction today, very simple, name the color. Why is it so simple? Because the cool part isn't necessarily the color. The cool part is we're doing this with magnets. See, magnet there, magnet there, magnet somewhere in there. So you just have to get it right. and the, and then I will put the magnets together and we'll see what we can make. Some kind of magnet thing. All right, are you ready? Hello everybody, how do you do? How do you do? How do you do? Hello everybody, how do you do? How do you do today? If your name is Sophia, Name the color. If your name is Landon, name this color. What color, Landon? What color? You were right. I know you said red. So we're going to put them together. Ready? Boing. Really cool magnets that they stick together. If your name is Journey, Name this color. Oh, Journey, what color have we got here? Green! All right, now let's see. Is it gonna... Oh, yep, that was the right side. Wait, if I would have put this side on, it wouldn't have stuck together. It just kind of pushes apart because some magnets don't get together. They have to be the opposite kind. Boing. See? If your name is Brittany, name this color. It's yellow. You were right. Bing. If your name is Brayden, name this color. Oh, it's kind of hard to see. Here. Yeah, I don't know. Can you see that, Brayden? What color is that? Mm -hmm. Blue. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I'll show you. That it wouldn't stick the other way, though. Whoa, whoa. Nope, nope. Oh, wait a minute. Oh. Inside the ball is both ends of the magnet. So yeah, it does stick. Silly me. <laughs> Not refilming. If your name is Thomas, name this color. It's red. All right, look, look, look. Oh, it's, it's reshaping itself. Look at, okay, we're gonna put the red one on. I'm trying to make it so you can see. Ah! Oh no, it's falling apart. Trust me, nobody got it wrong. Nobody got it wrong. It just came apart because the magnets are getting kind of heavy. Pretty cool though, huh? I like it. All right. The job for today is the shape person job. And we have been working on lots of different shapes. So the book for today is going to be the five little monkeys who jumped on the... They jumped on the... They jumped on the bed, which was naughty. Do not jump on your beds. Anyways... You'll find out what happens when you're naughty and you jump on your bed. So we are going to put the shapes together that we've been working on to see if you can make, you can draw a bed. All right, let's try it. Okay, we are going to draw a bed for the monkeys to jump on. So first we need to make that rectangle we've been practicing. One, two, here comes a long one, two, three is short, four, stop that's the bed that's like the mattress where you sleep we're gonna put a headboard here so we're just gonna make a long line it's a headboard with a little leg how about at the end it's another little leg and a little teeny footboard maybe now we're gonna make a pillow by drawing a square okay square here do 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 all right, so it kind of looks like a bed, very geometric bed, but just for fun, because you've been working on it, we're gonna put a guy on there. It'd be pretty hard to draw a monkey, so let's just draw a guy. So way up here above the bed, make your circle for the head, short line for the body, some legs, some arms, two eyes, a nose, and a smile, because he's having fun. Though he should not be jumping on the bed. 
All right, see if you can make that and then show me a picture, okay? Thanks guys.